you know, when you're looking at the supply chains and the issues that are going on, it's and uh, with the geopolitical issues that are going on, it's, it's really a perfect storm for us. It's uh, to allow us to become the first vertically integrated company in North America to be a, a sole provider of all these drugs from domestically produced uh, uh, supply chains. It's, it's going to be critical for the United States and Canada and Mexico. All right, welcome back inside our proactive newsroom. And joining me now is uh, Brent Willis. He is the CEO of Voyager Pharmaceuticals. And Brent, it's great to see you again. How are you? Good. How are you doing? I'm doing well, doing well. Uh, really interesting to read your uh, letter to shareholders, uh, just to talk about sort of where you're going with the company in 2025 and, and really about where you've been in 2024. And 2024, Brent, I think was a, a really pivotal year for the company, especially towards the end when you signed this letter of intent with a, a multinational pharmaceutical company. Uh, why don't we start there and talk to me a little bit about this particular deal and how that all that work that you did in 2024 really led up to that? Yeah, it's uh, it, it really all the work did really lead up to that. So uh, we got we caught the eye of, uh, you know, several big pharma companies and we had a lot of discussions with different groups and we're moving forward with one of those. And uh, it's significant in the fact that, uh, you know, you get a multinational contrast company that, uh, you know, is a major pharmaceutical company back in your projects. That is a, a huge step moving forward. And uh, once we uh, solidify what we're doing with them, uh, we'll have another announcement coming out here. Uh, we hope in the next 60 days, maybe 90 days, but uh, we're working with them to get through uh, their due diligence phase right now. And uh, what that's gonna do for us, it's it's really gonna allow us to accelerate our business plan. You know, our, our core of this company is building a radiology drug company and, uh, our Earth to Bottle is all about uh, sourcing our own minerals and uh, creating these drugs with a vertically integrated structure, which uh, saves an immense amount of costs. So uh, when we have somebody like that coming behind us, uh, it's, uh, it's just going to open up the, uh, the, our ability to continue to raise money at, at much higher share prices, less dilution, and bring in institutional investment and uh, accelerate all all our, our core which is uh, our barium uh, you know any iodine company what what what's the core core of a business is having a barium line an iodine line and an MRI uh, line which uh, currently companies use gadolinium where we're focused on creating a whole new line of drugs in that respect using our uh, fullerene uh, uh, carbon molecules so it's all very exciting, and uh, it really is uh, launching us forward here into uh, 2025. Our share price is reflecting that, and I think uh, you know our share price is really all about uh, this pending deal that's going to be announced here as we move forward. Yeah, uh, you also 2024 had a, a sales distribution contact uh, contract rather for Smooth X for the two percent barium contrast, but in this 2025. A lot of testing is going to be happening on that on that contrast, the barium line that you have, and that's uh, really the key start to the to this 2025. Yeah, year. that's that's our that's our number one focus right now is uh, is getting our products ready for market, uh, getting the clinical testing completed here, and uh, proving our performance of our of those products. And once that's done, that's going to open us up to uh, uh, advancing with the FDA so that we can access the U.S. market and European markets, and. Uh, so it, it's it's a major milestone that we're looking to, to uh, tick off here in, in the near future. And uh, in addition to that, we're advancing uh, with our uh, our streamlined uh, iodine process that uh, was developed by uh, our COO, Brad Willis. And he uh, had come up with a system where we believe that we can produce iodine direct from mineral brine water and uh, and reduce costs and go direct into drug manufacturing, which uh, will be a significant cost savings in the iodine drug market. And uh, we're also moving forward with our partner Raincage on uh, developing uh, a new MRI drug as we move forward. And we're partnering with Applied Pharmaceutical Innovations to make all that move forward. And uh, so really it's sales and then uh, solidifying this deal with the multinational, which will uh, allow us to just uh, have a three-pronged approach to really build this business up. And that's what, really what's going to build the value of this company. 
Yeah, and lastly, Brent, uh, in the news release, you talk about uh, supply chains and, and things that are going on around the world and uh, with, with the space that you're in. And there seems to be a, a very uh, strong niche for, for your company to move into to fill some of those gaps, which is, uh, which is really transformational for a company. Yeah, it's, uh, you know, when you're looking at the supply chains and the issues that are going on, it's, and uh, with the geopolitical issues that are going on, it's, it's really a perfect storm for us. It's uh, to allow us to become the first vertically integrated company in North America, to be a, a sole provider of all these drugs from domestically produced uh, uh, supply chains. It's, it's going to be critical for the United States and Canada and Mexico. We're going to be able to uh, really secure supply chains, ensuring that uh, uh, patients can uh, get the treatments they need in order to, uh, you know, live longer lives. It's, it really comes down to that. And we're going to be able to uh, reduce waiting times in hospitals because we're being able to supply these drugs domestically. It's It all really fully encompasses around, uh, you know, building a, a company that's uh, really focused on uh, the health of people. So. Yeah, it sounds like you got the strong vision and uh, and uh, also the barium to enhance that vision. So there you have it. Brent, thanks so much. Great to see you again. And uh, it was a good letter and uh, really uh, gave a, a good roadmap for 2025. Thank you very much. All right, Brent Willis, the CEO of Voyager Pharmaceuticals.